In this last example, we will see how a vertex will differ from a curved maximum or minimum point. Question three, find the absolute maximum and minimum values of f of x equals x to the power of two thirds on the interval negative two, three. Let's continue with our steps. If we evaluate the function at the end point and at zero we get f of negative two equals the cube root of four, f of three equals the cube root of nine, and f of zero is equal to zero. Let's take the first derivative of the function. f prime of x equals 2 thirds x to the negative 1 third power equals 2 over 3 times the cube root of x. As you can see, the evaluation of the first derivative at f prime of 0 will be undefined. Therefore, for the function on the given domain, the absolute maximum value is the cube root of 9, approximately 2.08, when x equals 3. And taking the smallest evaluated number, the absolute minimum value is 0 when x equals 0.